Hi, myself Dr. Bhargavi, Department of Anesthesia, Narayana Medical College, Nellur. Today I am here to talk a few words on the occasion of World's Anesthesia Day. Every year, 16th October is celebrated as World's Anesthesia Day to commemorate the first successful demonstration of ether anesthesia by Dr. W. T. J. Morton on 16th October 1846. Years ago, there were many painful surgeries, but now anesthesiologists made them pain-free. Relieving the pain to the patient is the biggest achievement. To mark the old anesthesia day, I could like to quit a few remarkable events from the history of anesthesia. In 15th century, Dr. Paracelsus discovered diethyl ether as an analgesic property, but it took three centuries for its use as anesthetic. In 1846, Dr. W. T. J. Morton successfully demonstrated ether in Massachusetts General Hospital, Boston. Dr. James Eng Simpson used chloroform in general anesthesia in 1847, but John Snow used chloroform inhaler and he also administered chloroform to Queen Victoria in her delivery. Sir Evans McGill contribution to anesthesia are innumerable, like ET intubation, diploma in anesthesia, endotracheal tubes, circuits, etc. We have advanced in many directions like use of newer inhalational agents, target control infusions, workstations, monitors, circuits, fiber optic devices, bispectral index, robotic anesthesia. Now the drive is towards the nanotechnology. What do anesthesiologists do? If you have asked this question before COVID-19 pandemic, you could have got an obvious answer that they make patient to sleep before surgery. But pandemic has added one more phase to it. They also ensure that patient awakes well. Yes, the world is starting to notice. We have been called as a frontline warriors on COVID-19 pandemic for simple yet vital and dangerous job. Anesthetists are the one who can stay calm in the middle of the stress, think on their feet and be creative. While treating the patient, we need to be diabetic specialist, asthma specialist, heart specialist and many. With this kind of training, anesthetists can be called into a play when there is a need. We cannot imagine having to go under knives without anesthesia, right? On this special occasion, I could like to thank all the anesthesiologists for making this possible and save many lives. Happy old anesthesia day. Thank you.